Lukato says once given the opportunity, the NDP will use government funds to provide free education up to tertiary level, as well as free healthcare services and create job opportunities for the youth to empower themselves. He says the Zambezi only has one state hospital, while clinics in the rural area also are not enough to cater for all residents. We are going to make sure that uh, uh, we, we establish the, the colleges for teacher education, not only in Katima itself, but also in the rural areas. Lukato further noted that the country is not safe for residents since independence, with an escalating crime rate and cross-border crime. He promised the NDP councillor will ensure security agencies are deployed throughout the country to protect citizens and avoid atrocities such as the recent death of fishermen. We promise further the following if you voted in power. You know, our people in this country, countrywide, they are not safe. Yeah, as crime is too high, and then we are going to make sure that we deploy the members of defense force can, uh, on, along, alongside of our territory so that uh, the country should be, be free from crime. NDP has seven candidates competing for the Katima Malilu local authority and five candidates for the Bukalo Village Council local authority.